Hello everybody, this is Pete Brooker from Human Research and this is a commentary on my workwear suit jacket from Universal Works, a British brand. They have three stores in the UK, two in London, one in Nottingham. Quite a small company, but this jacket I absolutely adore. It's a, It's got that, it's called the workwear suit jacket because it's inspired by the founder's father. I think his name's David Keat and his dad was a baker, I believe. So these are the sort of designs and cuts that the jackets that these people would be wearing back in them days and certainly in in factories so you have these kind of two large flat pockets at the bottom they're great for utility and the two open breast pockets at the top it's a free button front and notch lapels and it's quite a rugged cotton it's a very stiff uh, very warm jacket believe it or not even though it does look quite thin so I love it because it can just really pair with anything. Light blues, greys. Uh, I tend to not wear it with my denim because that's too blue on blue. But it's, it's just, it feels great as well. It's a, like I say, it's a good coarse cotton to wear and great to layer with. The missus hates this jacket, unfortunately, because she thinks it's too work-like. <laughs> she, she doesn't want me to go back to the factory and, in fact this jacket's now been excommunicated to the country and if she sees this jacket again she will actually send me back to the factory she keeps threatening me but anyway so this jacket um is basically uh made from blue byron twill it's a universal classic apparently universal works classic and can be worn buttoned right up to the neckline like a chore jacket um and it's got that small concealed lapel button as well which can come in handy it's made in Leicester in by the, the jeans maker Canty. They're using cotton twill supplied by Brisbane Moss. This jacket has a very sturdy workwear feel to it and will be a favourite for me, anyway, for a long time to come. And I love this kind of white ribbon tape that you see running on the inside. So it's unstructured. The, the pocket flaps are starting to dog ear a little bit. So, but that just adds to the character of this piece. Um, huge fan there you can see the the working soldier cuffs as well I've actually edited some of these photos over time and it's a little bit hard to figure out exactly why some of these are bright blue some of these are light blue but if you go over to the website then you'll figure out exactly the color of this jacket it's, it's very much a faded blue now anyway that's it from me uh, leave some comments below let me know what you think of the jacket I'll leave a link to the article that I wrote about this as well thanks a lot that's it for now